What's up guys? Welcome to my video and today I will be making a short review about this CC3D flight controller board. This board is 32 bit and can be configured to fly any airframe, for example a tricopter, a quadcopter, a helicopter and so on. It can be programmed using a Libre Pilot ground control station the clean flight, the open pilot and many more. But because the open pilot doesn't work anymore, I'll be using the Libre Pilot ground control station to program this flight controller. There are three types of the CC3D flight controller board and this one is a copter control. There is also the Atom but it's just the smaller version of this one. This board is pretty small and it weighs 8 grams. You can pick one for about $20 on Amazon, eBay and all that online shops. I'll leave the link in the description where you can buy one. So if you look closer to the board, we've got 6 PWM output connectors where you connect your servers or your ESC to. And it says S, the S stands for signal, the positive is a power supply and the negative is a ground so because i've just unboxed this flight controller i will now test it and see whether it's working or not so when we take an esc this is how it goes that's the wire of the esc as you can see that's the signal the red wire is a positive and the black one is a negative so that's the ground and you have to plug in it there like that and power up the ESCs. There should be a light on the board if it is broken. So that's it. As you can see, light or flashing. It shows that the board is working. So let me go on and disconnect it. So let's look closer again to the board. We've got three ports. We've got the main port, the flexi port, and the receiver port. The main port is optionally used for GPS or a Futaba serial bus receiver and satellite receivers. The flexi port is used for telemetries, GPS and I think OSD which is on screen display. And you connect your receiver to the board using a, a receiver port and these cables. The maximum allowed voltage of this board is plus 15 volts. A minimum of five volts so that was my video for today thumbs up if you like this video subscribe and stay tuned because i'll be building my first quadcopter with this board if you have a question post it in the comment section below all the links will be in the description where you can download the liberal power ground control station or buy this cc3d flight controller board so thank you and bye bye